We're back in Edmonton where the scores for Drobiasco and Vanagas, 5-1 to 5-3 for composition and 5-2 to 5-4 for presentation. On the ice right now, the national champions of Kazakhstan and the Asian Games gold medalist, Elizaveta Sterkonikova and Dmitry Karzaliga. She's from Moscow, so she's come under the influence of the Russian style of ice dancing. They now train in Lake Placid. They are coached by Natalia Dubova, one of the three great influences on Russian ice dancing. You'll notice this ice dance, it seems rather simple, rather straightforward. It's almost like one of the compulsory dances in the sense that it doesn't have a wide variety of movements or steps or dance steps or a great originality. See the manner in which he uses her as a cape? They finished 13th at the World Championships in 1995, tied for 10th coming into the original dance. Tied, incidentally, with two other couples. Mm -hmm. Three-way ties. Remember, this original dance counts for 30% of the total score. certainly presents an attractive figure on the ice and seems to move well. Which, of course, is exceedingly important for the way skaters stroke and edge. Are they deep edging? Is there deep stroking? Nice stretch to these moves. The dance steps, very traditional. The gold medalist from the Asian Games. And, of course, Chen Lu reigning world champion here this week in Edmonton competing for this year's championship won the gold medal for the Asian Games and of course you can see the ladies competition BBC's Wide World of Sports Saturday afternoon and the ladies long program Saturday night and the march for composition 4.9 up to 5.2 and for presentation, 5.0 to 5.2 for Sterkonikova and Karzaliga.